Hi, I'm Matthew Coast, head dating coach and founder at CommitmentConnection.com. And today we're going to talk about what do guys find attractive. So what do guys find attractive? If you're looking to attract a guy into a relationship of some kind, then knowing what men are attracted to is very, very important. So first let's talk about what is not attractive to men. So what guys are not attracted to is masculine women. Right, um, and if you are a masculine woman, there's a, um, th there's probably a feminine part of yourself that you can pull out and um, attract him with, but he will not be attracted to you for being a masculine woman. Um, that is just not attractive. Talking about guy topics or you know acting like one of the guys that is not attractive to men, and you will just end up as a friend. Um, the second one is being a strong, independent woman, and you no. Know, just recognize here, though, that there are attractive, strong, independent women, and there are unattractive, strong, independent women. And being a strong, independent woman has no bearing on whether you're attractive or not, right? And so don't expect a guy to be attracted to you because you're a strong, independent woman. Just realize that you can be attractive as, as a strong, independent woman. You can be very unattractive as a strong, independent woman. And know that that has no bearing on your attractive level, attractiveness level whatsoever. Uh, thinking that men are the problem. This is a huge thing that is very unattractive to men. Women all the time. Uh, if I go out and I'll talk to uh, women about what I do, and uh, a lot of times women will be like, "Well, why are you helping women? Women don't need the help. Men do. Men are the problem. You need to go and fix men because men are what's wrong with." you know relationships and that attitude is really really unattractive and that will keep you single for a very very long time um and it will destroy relationships that you get into so another thing that is not attractive is trying to fix or make men the way that you want them to be and so a lot of women kind of shame men or they condemn men or they try to force men to be the way that they want them to be and that is just not attractive in any way men want you to love and accept them for who they are and if you're trying to fix them or change them they don't feel like you love and accept them and they will pull away from you and they will disappear uh, so what is attractive? Let's talk about what is attractive to guys. Um, feminine energy is really attractive to guys. So ev everybody, men and women, all have a feminine and a masculine side. And so if you want to be attractive to men, pull out your feminine side when you're around them or pull it out before you get around them and so that it's you know open and expressive when you are around them. And that can be incredible. I mean, it's just insanely attractive to men. Uh, youthfulness, so being playful and youthfulness. A lot of women are like, oh, men just want the youngest, prettiest girl they can find. And, and there there is some truth to that. But in reality, what men really want is a woman who's youthful, right? If you act like you're an old woman, that is not attractive in any way. But being really playful, being really youth, you know, youthful, being really uh, young at heart, that is incredibly attractive to men. So the next one is being a woman of value. You know, um, being valuable to a man in his life is incredibly attractive to men. So, um, uh, you know, being someone who is is valuable to him, you know, someone that um, he can see, uh, you know, adding value to his life. You know, that is really powerful and can be incredibly attractive. And so the more you can show that you're in alignment with who he is and where he's going, uh, the more he can see you as being relationship material. Um, and so the last one is connecting to his heart, right? Connecting to his emotions is really, really powerful and really attractive. Men don't get emotions. And women tend to get emotions a lot better than men do. And so if you can connect with your emotions and bring him into your world, you know, not a world of expectations and trying to get him to do certain things because you, you know, showed your emotions, but just allowing yourself to uh, be in your emotions and express your emotions in a healthy way, um, that can be incredibly attractive to men. It's not looked at as drama. A lot of women think that men think emotions or drama that is not the case at all you know what men think is drama is expectations 
not emotions. Emotions are attractive. Expectations are unattractive. So that's it for today. If you want more information on how to attract a quality man into a committed, loving, secure relationship, make sure you go to my website at commitmentconnection.com and take the quiz there. I'm Matthew Coast, and I'll speak with you again soon.